I'm Trav. And I'm Tay. And, and where Trav, Trav Tay plays. That's what you do. Hey guys, Travis from Trav Tay plays. Hello from Trav Tay plays. And we're gonna check out more Resident Evil Village. Uh, also known as Resident Evil 8. Alright guys, here we go. Now we're here to give you an exclusive first look at Resident Evil Village gameplay. Just like in Resident Evil 7 Biohazard, you'll be taking control of Ethan Winters. The you setup for this is already a bajillion castle. times cooler than um, 7. Players will need to get in and search for their kidnapped daughter. As they had, he has now, a daughter? Resident Did he have a daughter in 7? The first person perspective. I'm not sure. Oh, so this might... really Maybe. draws players into the detailed world we've created. Does he still have that giant fucking scar on his wrist from when he got his hand cut off? You know, I don't know. Maybe we can find out in a little bit. Yeah. Whoa, Jeez Louise. I love it. Yeah. Wish, I wish this was my fucking house. I know it's not a house, it's a castle. I just wish this was a castle. You'll see a lot of chandelier details amazing. come to life here. This is pretty dope. Yeah. Getting some like Resident Evil 1 vibes, right? Because you go through like a mansion. Yeah. But this is like first person. Yeah. I wish you could do third person in this, but you can't. I don't know. Maybe this can be an option. I don't know. I don't know. It wasn't in 7. No, it wasn't. Everything Somebody did want it to where they could do it, so like that. Visuals. <laughs> now it's time to meet some of the castle denizens. As you'd expect, a warm welcome's not really what's in store for you. <laughs> oh no. Man blood. <laughs> Uh, oh, oh! That looks painful. Now, some. Let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Shifting gears a bit, we're finally going to show off some combat. Mm. I mean, it's gotta be like seven, right? I mean, probably. It's not just about shooting. Guarding will also be an important part of the game. Where'd that sword come from? I don't know. So definitely gotta guard a lot. Oh, uh, maybe it dropped the sword. Each type of enemy. Cool has their own What's that thing back? Oh my God! Oh. Those things are like werewolves. Ooh, like hammer dude. Yeah, Bad this is like ass. real this is bloodborne all of a sudden. Some of you will remember a similar management system in Resident Evil 4. This time around, nice. we've added crafting, which nice. allows you to create items such as first aid and ammo. There's also an assortment of weapons to find and utilize throughout nice. the game. Been waiting for you, Mr. Winter. Oh my god. <laughs> How do you know my name? Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. <laughs> the merchant makes a return. This time he's known as the Duke. You'll be going to him to buy and sell weapons, amongst other things. The director what wanted you to buy? Him a unique look, and you'll what often you find him in different situations. Uh, each guy. time you encounter. No, but uh yeah. does does the same thing. He's an interesting yeah. fella. Batter. Smash away with your trusty knife. <laughs> There's plenty of items to find in your travel. Wait, do you hear that? And we've also got extra objectives outside of the main one. Huh. Interesting. Of course, it goes without saying that there'll be plenty of puzzles to solve for Sweet, players I love to move puzzles. forward. Oh, and uh, oh, shit. plenty of surprises to keep you on your toes. You would hope so. Yeah. Ow. Ooh. Ew. 
it is coming out of his skin? Yeah. <laughs> I haven't cut open a man in a while. Oh, it's that chick. Let me string you up. Slice one of your them. jugular and just yeah. walk. <laughs> oh, that's scary. <laughs> oh. Well, that's one way to end the video. Now that we've shown you what's in store for Resident Evil Village, let's take a look at the exclusive PlayStation 5 demo. Ooh. Yeah, we might have to download this after. Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, after this demo. Players won't be playing as Ethan, but as a character we're referring to as the Maiden. Huh. Unlike the actual game, this experience doesn't feature combat or even blocking. Okay. I think it's more like boring than that. I don't think it's supposed to be like a like a like a prequel. Or like a like a what do they call it? A, a prologue. Mm -hmm. It might be a prologue. We're hoping to have players get a real feel for the visuals and audio as they take the maiden on her journey to find a way out of the castle. And you can download the exclusive demo on PlayStation 5. Today today well that's it guys uh maybe we'll play that demo here in a little bit oh shucks um don't forget to check us out we got all of our links below twitch.tv slash live the instagrams the twitters the tiktoks and um oh check out the podcast the rum about podcast um oh gosh i hope i put a link below all right well that's gonna be everything peace